Roads and buildings submerged in flood water, homes destroyed. Residents of this town in southeastern Madagascar assess the damage after Cyclone Batsurai lashed the coastline late Saturday night. University students in this house were sleeping when water rushed inside. We got up to move the furniture while water continued to rise. The house started to crack. Some of our furniture was still upstairs and the crack started to get worse. Now some of our belongings have been destroyed. Batsurai touched down in the city of Mananzari, packing winds of 165 kilometers per hour, though gusts eventually weakened to around half that speed. The cyclone caused power cuts in some areas and displaced almost 48,000 people. Some took refuge in evacuation centers. We live on a hill on the edge of a cliff. The wind was strong, but our house is strong. Early in the morning, there was a landslide. The World Food Programme has started distributing hot meals to affected residents and plans to set up cash transfers in the coming days. The damage from Batsurai is compounding the destruction of another cyclone, Anna, which hit the island two weeks ago. It killed at least 58 people and forced 130,000 people from their homes. Madagascar is one of the world's poorest countries, with three-quarters of its population living below the poverty line.